a um, looking at this website, and it says there's supposedly 144,000 casing stones in the Pyramid of Giza, Giza, whatever. So, 144,000 is pretty bloody specific because of the four horsemen. There's supposed to be 144,000 people to supposedly survive the apocalypse. And there's exactly 144,000 days in a full Mayan Bakhtun. So, once again, the Egyptians and the Mayans are connected. They both incorporate Pi in their pyramids, and they both have the same uh, digits for 144,000. Now, this is a little cool. You should. I'm just starting this website design class, so go to my website, um, benvelars.com. And it'll, it's sort of cut and paste right now, and then I put my ideas in between it, like the facts, and then my ideas in between it. Um, but yes. Um, the golden ratio. Sorry. The golden ratio is 1.618, blah, blah, blah. So, you know me. I, I did some math, and I did pi times... 26, because 26 is a very holy Mayan number, and it's 81681, you know, golden ratio is 1.618, and then I did pi divided by 144, and that's 0 0.0218 um, I did 72 times the golden ratio, which is 116.4, um, whatever, <laughs> and it's just like, all of those incorporate 1618. I mean, it's just, I find it very interesting. The Mayans are into fractals, and the golden ratio is kind of in, it's kind of in their fucking mathematics. It's a little, it's a little uh, chilling, I think. And I'm starting to read about um, John Hutchison. Crazy dude, crazy dude. Um, he's taking Tesla to a, a different level with anti gravity. That's what they think UFOs are essentially uh, made of is what Hutchison is finding out. And astrologically, Tesla and Hutchison have Jupiter conjuncting Neptune, which is very interesting. And they both have Uranus in Gemini, and they have Saturn in Cancer like Nostradamus. So, yeah, astrology is very important when you want to speak of people's influence with each other. So... But yeah, go to my website, check it out.